Hello everyone. Greetings of the day. Hope you are all doing fine. So today we are going to discuss about right to education as a fundamental right given in our Indian Constitution. So the Constitution Act of two thousand two, which is the eighty sixth amendment, inserted Article twenty one clause A in the Constitution of India. to provide free and compulsory education of all children in the age group of 6 to 14 years as a fundamental right in such a manner as the state may by law determine the right of children to free and compulsory education which is also known as rte uh, rte act 2009 which represent the consequential legislation envisaged under the article 21a means that every child has a right to full time elementary education of satisfactory and equitable quality in a formal school which satisfies certain essential norms and standards article 21a and rte act came into effect on 1st april 2020 the title of the rte act incorporates the word free and compulsory free education means that no child other than a child who has been admitted by his or her parents to a school which is not uh, supported by an appropriate government shall be liable to pay any kind of fee or charges or expenses which may prevent him or her from pursuing and com- uh, completing his elementary education compulsory education casts an obligation on the appropriate government and local authorities to provide and ensure admissions attendance completion of elementary education by all the children in the age group of 16 to 14 with this india has moved forward to a rights based right based uh, framework that casts a legal obligation on the central and state governments to implement this fundamental child right as enshrined in article 21a of the constitution in accordance with the provisions of the rte act the rte act provides for the right of children for free and compulsory education till compulsory uh, till completion of elementary education in a neighborhood school it clarifies the compulsory education means obligation of the pro- appropriate government to provide free elementary education and ensure compulsory admission attendance and completion of elementary education to every child in 6 to 14 age group free means that no child shall be liable to pay any kind of fee or charges or expenses which may prevent him or her from pursuing or completing his elementary education it makes provision for non admitted child to be admitted to an age of appropriate class it specifies the duties and responsibilities of appropriate governments local authority and parents in providing free and compulsory education and sharing of the financial and other responsibilities between the central and state government it lays down the norms and standards relating inter alia to pupility cho ratios that is ptrs buildings and infrastructure school working days teacher working hours etc it provides for rational development of teachers by ensuring that the specified pupil teacher ratio is maintained for each school rather than just as an ad, uh, average for the state or district or block thus ensuring that there is no urban rural imbalance in teacher postings it also provides for prohibition of deployment of teachers for non educational works other than decennial census elections to local authority state legislatures and parliament and disaster relief it provides for appointment of appropriately trained teachers that is teachers with requisite entry and academic qualification it prohibits physical punishment and mental harassment screening procedures for admission of children capitation fees private tuition by teachers and running of school without recognition it provides for development of curriculum in consonance with the values enshrined in the constitution and which would ensure the all round development of the children building the child's knowledge and potentiality and talent and making the child free of fear trauma and anxiety anxiety through a system of child friendly and child centered learning so that's it for today you can ask me any questions in the comment box so have a nice day